Welcome back to Rick Riley's World, where we look at Rick's vast collection. What are we looking at this week, Rick? Well, it's a 1962 Willys pickup truck with a well drilling rig on the back of it. Got this truck out of, uh, it was in Illinois, it belonged to the state. And all this stuff here has got to be all rebuilt and stuff. It's, I ain't had a chance to do anything to it yet, but it's, uh, it's going to be a project because everything pretty much froze up on it from sitting around so much. But it's pretty, it's a pretty neat vehicle the way they got it set up. It had just got a um, twin stick PTO unit on it. Uh, it's of course, T93 speed. Just, it's going to just take a lot of work to get it straightened around, but it'll be different once it's all done. It's got, uh, right back here is one of the augers for it. And bed there. And there's your hydraulic outfit that runs all the uh, unit on the back. One point in time, somebody's put a uh, 289 or 302 in a uh, Ford engine. And here's some more of the augers for, for the front. It originally had a PTO winch on the front of it, and I guess they took it off when they put all those augers there because the fair lead's still there. But it's, it'd be a good winter project. Uh, hopefully, the next Jeep show we have, uh, Hopefully, maybe have it running and digging to see see how it works. You keeping that motor? Or are you looking for? No, I've, I've got another. I've got the original six cylinder put back in it. I've got that down in the barn and get that out and just put it all back the way it was. And everything else on is pretty solid. It's not really rusty. Well, this is part of your working Jeep collection. Well, uh, coming up, what, how many we got to look at as far as working Jeeps? Now we've got a one with a backhoe, one with a trencher, one with a wrecker unit on it, two of them with wrecker units on them. You got two backhoes, don't you? Two, and one with another Willie's truck with a backhoe on it. It'll be we'll be getting getting around to here in the next next week or two, and hopefully I'll get them out and have them running and working, and show you how they all all they how they work. Well, we're looking forward to that. I guess we'll catch you next time. Okay, thanks a lot.